G'day guys, it's your favourite Aussie again, living in Zimbabwe, Peter Zimmerman. Just here to talk to you about my phase two project with Solar Energy. Um, it's a SunSync unit, a 50 kVA. Um, it's a beautiful system, I have all the solar panels on my workshop and also on my grading shed. Uh, the panels and the system run everything on the farm up at this end, the functional area, which is all three houses, the workshop, uh, the tunnel, six barns, and also the grading shed. And also runs my full compound, uh, which is uh, 40 houses. Anyway, very happy with the system. Uh, Technology is very good. I've got an app where I can monitor everything. Um, sometimes the system you know, is getting peaked out and I can actually turn things off and turn things on and have full control, which has been very beneficial to the business and the farm. So during the wet season, uh, we actually had a fault in the dam and I lost a third of my water, which made me have to look for water elsewhere. Fortunately on the farm, we have plenty of underground water. So uh, we developed a project three, which was drilling two boreholes, uh, both uh, catering for 20 horse pumps. So two 20 horse pumps and the system is managing that quite well. Um, obviously when the, generate, when the electricity comes back, uh, the SunSync unit will back off the power from the generator slowly and then also let it give it time to cool down, which is a huge maintenance value. Um, as you know, that's probably the biggest problem farming in Zimbabwe is your maintenance. So, off the top of my head, last year I've actually used 70,000 litres of diesel and this year I'm down to 25. So I've more than halved it and I'm probably about two thirds through my crop. So thank you Solar Energy. I'm winning.